Our base for that is the inside zone. What I'd like to talk about are our offensive line rules for running inside zone. The rules are really very simple. I'm, I'm big into simplicity. Uh, I like to run a lot of different uh, plays, but with very, very few blocking schemes. I'm the offensive line coach. I limit our run blocking schemes to three. We run inside zone, outside zone, and power or gap scheme, same scheme. Inside zone, outside zone, power. Our triple option is based off of our inside zone scheme. We're either covered, well, that means you've got a, a defensive lineman lined up over you, or you're uncovered, which means you're covered by a linebacker as an offensive lineman. And your rules are based off of that. Now, if you're covered, you're either covered play side, or you're covered backside. Now here's what that means. Say the center's in here, and I'm the guard. All right, I'm down. There's a guy covering me. The guy's either on this shoulder, or he's on this shoulder. I tell him if he's ever head up, say he's backside, just to make it easy. But if you're covered, you are either got a guy on your inside shoulder or a guy on your outside shoulder. Now, which way's the play going? If we call inside zone to the right, and the center's in here, the play's coming this way. If a guy's on my inside shoulder, I'm covered backside because he's away from the play. Play's going to the right, he's on my inside, I'm covered backside. Or if the guy's on this shoulder, I'm covered play side. So all the way across the line, I'm either covered play side, covered backside, or I'm uncovered. That's where our rules start from. Inside zone, which is the basis of our triple triple option. If you're covered play side, you're going to do what we call drop drive. I'll go over what that means in just a second. If you're covered back side, you're going to do what we call saddle flipper. So you either, if you're covered, there's a guy on you, you're either covered play side or covered backside, and that's what you're going to do. If you're uncovered, there's nobody over you, you're going to zone double. And that's it, period, end of story, makes it real easy. Now, but what does that mean? Here's, here's where we go with it, all right? Say I'm the center. Let's make that I'm the center. Quarterback's right behind me, but this is true for tackle, guard, center, Guard, tackle, tight end, all the way across. All right, let's say we're running inside zone to the right, and I'm covered with a guy shaded to my right. I'm covered play side. I'm going to drop step, which means take a step off the line of scrimmage. There's a board at a 45. Step over that board. That'll put your eyebrows down the play side number and then drive. All right, now, what this Causes the defender to do, if you try to get your hat to his play side number, he's taught one of two things. Either try to get penetration and don't worry about it, and not very good, not a very good team, or try to keep his outside arm free. Well, if I step and try to get my hat on that play side number, he's going to fight that way, well, then drive on track, and I've cleared out that piece of real estate through the A gap. So if I'm covered play side, I'm the guard, there's a, I got a three technique, drop, Make it make my hat go to his play side number and then drive. He ought to keep that outside arm free, which cleans out this inside piece of real estate. There's the center. I'm the left guard. He's covered play side. He's in a one technique or two. I'm gonna drop, and I'm gonna get my hat on that. But I either got my hat inside so the ball can come inside, or he fights hard to keep that arm free, and I wash him across, still clearing out that piece of real estate on the inside. So uh, all the way across, covered play side, drop step and get your hat to the play side number and drive, staying on your track. Now, let's say I'm the center and I'm covered backside, plays inside zone to the right. I've got a shade to my left. Now my rule is saddle, which just means pick that foot up and put it down. Just picking it up and putting it down. Just buying time for the guard to get here. Saddle, flipper. Now I'm back on a 45 degree track. All right, if I'm the backside, there's the center, I'm the left guard, and I've got a three technique. I'm covered, back, he's not in here, play side, he's here. Backside, I'm going to saddle, 
Flepper, now on the same track as the center was when he had the backside shade on a 45. And I'm going to duck walk to the next level.